Hey what's up guys, in this video I will be showcasing you how you can take a screenshot with the 4 different methods on Galaxy A36 5G. The first way to take a screenshot is using the 2 button combination. To use this method you need to press the volume down and the power button simultaneously and you can take the screenshot quite easily. You can find these buttons on the right side of your device. So quickly press and release both of these buttons to take a screenshot. Another advantage of this method that it is going to be work even your device is locked. Do note that if you press and hold both of these buttons then the power menu will pop up. So don't press and hold both of these buttons just press and release them immediately so you can take the screenshot. Now the second method to take a screenshot on the Galaxy A36 5G is using the palm swipe gesture. To take the screenshot simply swipe your palm across the screen from left to right or right to left to take a screenshot. To do this, you should have the edge of your palm close to the screen and slightly bend it. This will save the screenshot on your device. This will help you to take the screenshot on your device. If you are having a trouble with this method, then there are a couple of things you can check. Firstly, ensure that the palm swipe gesture is enabled in the settings. So open up your settings, scroll down towards advanced feature and then motion and gesture. Here make sure the swipe to capture toggle button is on. If you are using the screen protector on your device, you may need to adjust your touch sensitivity setting as well. To do this, open up your settings, then display and toggle on the touch screen sensitivity on. Now with this setting enabled, you should be able to take the screenshot using the palm swipe gesture without any issue. Now the third method to take a screenshot is using the edge panel. To use this method, go to the edge panel by pulling this handle, swipe through the boards until you reach the task page. Look for the take screenshot button and tap on it. It will save the screenshot on your device. If you cannot find the task page on your edge panel, you can add it to your settings. So open up your settings. Go inside display, then scroll down and select edge panel. Make sure this toggle button is on and then tap on panels. Select the task page from the available boards by tapping on it. You will see a check mark that confirms the board has been added. In the future, capturing the screenshot will be easy for you. Simply open up the edge panel, tap on the screenshot and you can easily take the screenshot using this particular method. Next method to take a screenshot on the Galaxy A36 5G is using the screenshot button. To begin this, navigate to the page that you want to capture. Swipe down from the top of the screen to access the quick panel. Once the quick panel is open, locate and tap on screenshot button. This will capture the screen and save the image as a screenshot. If you cannot find the take screenshot button in the quick panel, open the quick panel by swiping twice down on the screen from the top. You will see a pencil icon at the top of the screen. Tap on it. From here, you can select whether you want to add the button on the top or the full section of the panel. Select any one of them and then search for the take screenshot button. Now from the available buttons, tap and hold to take the screenshot button and drag it onto the top. Finally, tap done and you will find the take screenshot button in the quick panel. Next, we have a bonus tip for you. A long or a scrollable screenshot is a method to save multiple pages on the one screenshot. So let me show you how you can do it. To start with, go to the page or the app you want to save the screenshot. For example, let me go to the settings. Take a screenshot using any of the method before. I will be using the screenshot in the quick panel method. After taking the screenshot, you will get this toolbar with a down arrow. Tap on that until you reach the end of the page or stop tapping the long screenshot button. The screenshot will automatically save to the gallery by default. To access the screenshot, go to the gallery, then album. The screenshot folder will appear and you will find out all the screenshot irrespectively of the method you have used. So guys, these are the simplest methods through which you can take a screenshot on your Samsung Galaxy A36 5G. I hope this video has helped you out in some way. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Peace.